The age of the influencer is over. The time of the buck has come. Here we go. I got my free ambience brought to you by Blizzard Entertainment. This is Blizzard North. Wow. Anyways, this was playing when I was doing that uh, one of my videos that you'll see later on. And so I just got it going because I have this. Well, I don't even want to explain my computer situation, but uh, as my calories are going down over at price and over prices is going up one pound per workout, it's getting a little uh, a little tougher. Oh man, I'm losing over the back of my belt there. It's good. That doesn't look very good. Don't judge me though. Don't write anything in the comment section about that. So, anyways, I got I did my uh, yeah two eighty two point six. That's pretty good. And uh, what I've done to my I brought my TRT dose down and to just two fifty a week because I'm getting like my muscles are uh, getting inflamed. I don't know. Maybe it's a gear issue. Maybe my Anyway, so 250 a week, that's, you know, that's real TRT. And so anyways, um, I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, well, I haven't added anything else to the stack. I'm going to get a uh, L-citrulline, okay? L you can get it in bulk from bulk supplements. You can get it up to 25 kilos, which costs $750. That would be the most cost-effective way to do it. But, I mean, um, that if, if, if I'm ever hosting an L-citrulline party, I'll, I'll, that's what I'll have to get. That's basically like... I don't know. That's like that's actually having like like having fifty kegs at one party, in terms of because you know apparently the maximum effective dosage of l citrulline is about ten grams per day, and it has I think this guy mentioned this is a two hour half life, so you have, you have to take it multiple times a day, and you want to take it, since it's an amino acid you have to take it on an empty stomach if you want to absorb it optimally because I don't think you absorb very much of it. The benefit of of that is to um, the l citrulline converts into l arginine. And then L-arginine produces nitric oxide and, uh, you know, dilates the blood vessels. And whenever you get more vascularity and improves, it improves uh, muscular uh, performance. And, but if you take L-arginine, you don't, you hardly absorb any of it. And so L-citrulline is the way to do it. And, uh, yeah, you can buy that with Sienna. I'm not recommending this. This is what I'm doing, although I'm out right now. But I still have, I still have a lot of beetroot extract and... Um, cranberry something. Cranberries and beetroots. Those produce nitric, nitric, nitric oxide. And I think chocolate has something to do with that. I've been eating chocolate. I'm, I think I'm addicted to chocolate again. But I still only eat two pieces a day, which is actually four little bricks. But, I mean, it's only 160 calories. And it's 100% cocoa. And most people don't really have the... Uh, they're too sugar addicted to enjoy that. But that and grapefruit juice. I could drink the whole freaking bottle of grapefruit juice, but I mean, I might as well kiss my teeth goodbye if I do that. Anyways, this set uh, is feeling pretty good. I uh, yeah, I was just I was gonna go for nine, but then I'm like, nah, I gotta I gotta go for ten. There's there's a guy in the Discord. He didn't get his set today. I'll do one extra up for him. You know how they you see these lame movies and they pour out a little they pour out some alcohol on the ground for their uh, fallen comrades. Well, I'm doing an extra rep for him. Yeah. And I, oh god. Yeah. I might have to redo this whole thing. Just kidding. Here we go. I didn't even have to hitch. Don't be a hitcher. Okay, so I don't want my StarCraft music going too loud, so I'm going to have to get up here with you. Whoosh. Whoosh. Yeah. Yeah, I still got this shirt. And I bet you you're wondering, this is your first time tuning in, why the hell are you wearing that shirt? And also, what the hell happened to it? Well, if I told you, you wouldn't believe me. So I'm just gonna you just I'm just gonna have to leave it to your own imagination. Okay, I guess but we should get to the tier list. Okay, good, nothing weird showing. Tweety. Okay, this is called 
gym equipment to your list. And my friend from the great country, former sorry, formerly great country, Germany, Deutschland. The the Rhine, he's a Rhinelander. Home of Rhine. Uh like ham and stuff. Uh and uh what else? What else has rinds? Uh oranges and lemons. That's that's all the same thing, right? Maybe I'm thinking of brine. Brine, Rhine, that's close enough. Okay, so this is this this is um this is our list here. You could say this is S tier. You could say this is F tier. Maybe you could say this is Z tier. But I make my own tiers. I don't. I'm, I'm not a cookie cutter. Hopefully you can hear me. Hopefully you can hear the music a little bit. Because I want to have a good ambience. Okay. I want to keep you on edge. This isn't a relaxing sort of thing. Even though I said I do ASMR, but today is an ASMR. Unless I don't even know what ASMR stands for. But this tier list, is, I'm not messing around. That's what I'm trying to say. I just had to use a bunch of words because I'm taking nicotine and I just had a coffee and 400 milligrams of caffeine earlier in pin, in pill form. Okay, so uh, what do we got here? We got a squat rack, or sorry, squat stand with a barbell on it. Presumably, you're going to do overhead pressure squats. You need that up here. That's in the need tier. Okay, this is a ball. Uh, why is there a ball in the gym? This, this is for lifting weights. It's not for fucking playing squash or tennis. Okay. Uh, we got another ball. What's the fucking ball for? There was this game we played in high school where you uh, you uh, we have those those big balls and people would run into each other. And I'm pretty sure they don't allow them to do it anymore, but my friend thought he was invincible. I mean, this is the teenage years. He'd probably still do it today. But um, he decided that he was going to run, he was going to go full tilt at the kid that weighed like 80 pounds more than he did, and it didn't go so good. He, he, was, he had a bad day. Okay. What are you, some kind of idiot or something? Dumbbells. Um, stupid. I know that's a hot take. Smith machine. Oh, jeez. Yeah. What else do I need to say? If you're using the Smith machine, you're probably a freaking, you're definitely a fruitcake. Kettlebells, there we go. Jump rope. Well, see, Muhammad Ali could—he was using—he was jumping rope, and he could beat me up. Uh, so I don't want to say that that's. Um, and I'm just gonna put this up here. This means dot dot dot. This can mean many things. Most of the time, to me, it means th that facial expression. It's almost like face palm worthy, but in this case, it will say it's a. Um, We'll leave it up to your own interpretation of it, okay? I just don't want to get beat up by Muhammad Ali if he gets resurrected. Uh, we got a band here. Oh, this is to work your uh, tiny little side uh, medial glute muscles, which are so small that they couldn't possibly make your ass look any better. So, uh, what are you, an idiot? So, okay, here's barbell on the floor. This guy's sumo deadlifting, fruitcake tier. This is some sort of log. Uh, I don't know, like between the balls and the log. What's the? Why is there a log in the gym? It's like a like a conveyor belt roller. Okay, that's there's no place for that in the gym. Here you go, weightlifting belt. You need to get that. If you don't have that, then stop being a cheap bastard, and don't pretend like you're working your core less. Your core, the core. Don't pretend like you're working your core any uh, any less if you're using that. Okay. What the hell is this thing? Oh, this is the uh, parallel par parallel weight stack. So this is for doing cable crossovers and for doing some doing some curls. Okay, where you're coming in like this. Ha <laughs> ha. Hey! <laughs> yes! Okay, my biceps are bigger than yours. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm bigger than every single person that watches my videos, except for one guy. So I don't want to fucking hear it. Well, my triceps are tiny, but that's just a genetic thing. My nose is bigger than yours, so shut the fuck up. Exactly. Alright, so we got some, uh, uh, what is this called? Like, this isn't hanging. 
It's you're hanging a little. It's not this quite the the old the one you think of. This is like the back supported hanging posted up leg raises. Uh, well, that thing only has one purpose, and it's just that stupid exercise, which doesn't really work your your abs all that much, quite like uh, squats and overhead press does. So we're gonna go down to the what are you an idiot tier just for buying that equipment? You're not quite to fruitcake though. Uh, lat pull downs. Lat pull downs is just means you're too fat to do chin ups or too weak. Chin up bar, very good. This is also I think one of those. I remember the one the one that I had. Um, it you could you could also do like some push ups on it and get a little more range of motion. But why would you do push ups when you can do bench press? Oh, leg press. Um, there we go. You're just uh, you you don't know how to do you don't know how to do a proper squat, so you do leg press. And if you're one of these guys that puts every plate on there, then I mean you probably I mean, you might deserve to be in the fruitcake tier. Uh, this is a bench for well, this is you don't need this one, but this guy's gonna do some skull crushers. Okay. Uh, well, no, we'll put this up here because the, it's a treadmill. I don't know if you're aware of this, but um, you can go outside and go for a walk. You don't have to stand on a conveyor belt. Okay. Uh, leg curls. Leg curls. Um, why would you do leg curls when you can do Romanian deadlifts? Okay. Uh, this right here. Oh, this is the um, seated calf raises. Okay. Another stupid exercise. That's to work the um, the not the, the the muscle that's not the gastrocnemius, because whenever I've done that, you know, I don't feel as much my gastrocnemius. And what I used to do for calf raises was I put my <coughs> toes on the bottom of the leg press and then just do calf raises like that. But when you train squats, you're doing your calves, and doing calf raises is only going to give you like uh, compared to just doing squats, doing adding calf raises on top of squats is only going to make like a two percent difference in your the, the look of your calves. And so, why even waste the fucking time? Just just get your squat up to f fucking 500 pounds. Uh, curl bar. Um, this one isn't need. Maybe we need another tier where it's like... We'll put it up in here. Okay. This one is good, especially if you're like me and you can't supinate your hand fully. If you want to be a curl specialist, then that's the one you want to get. Also, But also, that one's good for doing the, uh, the, um, the skull crushers. And so, yeah, because the angle of your hand doesn't matter for triceps. And so you can have, you can have this grip, you could do this grip, but why would you do this grip? You could do, you do this fucking grip. I wish I could turn my hand all the way. Halo fucked me up last night. You see that? It's my, this is my arm wrestling picture. No, no, or you gotta be like John Brzee and go. Okay. Uh, peck deck, uh, fruitcake. That just gives you a bunch of inflammation. That doesn't really make your pecs... Well, I guess it'll make your pecs look puffier because you have inflammation. Um, cable preacher curls. Uh, there we go. We'll put this up here, actually. That doesn't deserve that much hate. This one can go up here. You don't need this one. Although, no, well, this, this thing's good. It'll, it's going to go with this. That way you can do bench press. Uh, oh, here we go. We got seated rows. Okay. Why would you do seated rows when you can do chin-ups? Look how much money I just saved you guys. Okay, you don't need any balls or logs or bands or this thing or leg press. All you need is a bar, a belt. So let's go. Look, we got a bar. Let's good. You can get a bar from row. Let's say I'm just gonna estimate all these together. That thing is probably like 200 if you want a good one. Maybe maybe 100. The belt, uh, a good bench because you need a good bench. You don't wanna you don't wanna get uh, you don't want it to tip over when you're doing your bench press. You're going to spend $2,000, okay, because you need plates. So $2,000, look for used plates. Uh, don't get the ugly, don't get the shittier ones, okay. It's, if you have to spend a little money to actually get plates that look like they're the, the weight that they say they are, then do that. But, um, you, frankly, you're well, I think that's a starting strength belt. Anyways, uh, also, you want to get a belt with one hole, not the two holes, because the two-hole one is hard to get out of. Unless it's just, like, one prong, and then there's there's, like... There's offset holes, so there's there's like twice as many holes for people that are like I don't know they their weight fluctuates a lot. But if you um, 
If you're like in between holes, just put an extra shirt on or take your shirt off. Okay. Anyways, you're welcome. I remember when we we did something called uh, Jump Rope for Heart. And I remember we'd always listen to the song by uh, the Pointer Sisters. Uh, El Campeon. Is this the guy that drinks the mouthwash? Okay. Hold on. Make sure there's clips on there at least. Oh, shit, it is. All right. Yep. Oh, my God. I do this every workout. Okay. Oh man. He's got two belts on. PR lifestyle is more than just hitting a PR in the squat for your deadlift. I hit PR every day. It's like I spent two million dollars on cam girls in one afternoon. That's a PR. Yeah. And today is a special day because we are here with the champ. This is like some Howard Stern stuff. They're exploiting uh, mental uh, slow people. Our champion. Yeah. Welcome to the channel. Oh yeah, me gusta. I like it. <laughs> Por ti también. Buen muchacho. Pendejo. <clears throat> Estoy feliz de estar aquí, pues de conocer a Larry. For me, es me siento I'm happy, feliz. Y pues yeah. vamos a realizar. I'll teach you a couple things. Bonita actividad. This guy, come, come on, they should have told him to put on a blue pair of shorts. This, is, este this is obscene. Here we go. To the squats. Okay. God sure. bless. Let me drink my mouthwash. Whoa! Starting with two plates. Six. Sí, sí. <laughs> what? No warm up, nothing. Permíteme. <laughs> no way. You're not starting with three. This is crazy. No. He's already warm. <laughs> oh, Larry, no, Larry's. Larry's. Uh, he's goading him into it. It's reverse psychology. <laughs> You're crazy, man. <laughs> well, I wrap myself. He's gonna be walking up there like a mummy. No warm up. He just drove an hour to get here. No warm up at all. Quick, what's in his bag? <laughs> wow. Look at all that crest mouthwash. Un poquito de paz. Dile que me tengo un poquito de paciencia en lo que me amarro, mijo. Sí, sí. Okay. No shit. The gym with this on his back. Un poquito de paciencia. After eight hours of landscaping, hard labor. That's why he's our champion. I thought he was our champion. Wait, wait. wait. That means a uh, campy pee on. Is that? No, that was lame. Sir, two wraps that per leg? Si, es mi sopor. <laughs> two wraps, two belts. But he's not two, wrapping it. Two very shots tight. of mouthwash. It's very loose wrap. Only one more, mijo. No way. <laughs> whoa, whoa. What is it? Yeah. Why does this guy still do landscaping when There's he's going to be the world fucking champion? He's going to be the world fucking champion. I kid you not. There's at least 13 pairs of wraps in this bag. He's not even wrapping them that tight. I don't think this guy's serious. I, I don't know where to. I don't know where to say. <laughs> He's, his boots aren't even. His boots aren't even stained green. Is this guy a real fucking landscaper? Three wraps on each leg. I'm pretty sure those are just gimmick boots. I got me. There you go. All right, that's my top belt. There's all. Oh, there's my lower belts. <laughs> All right, here's my inside belt. They come in. At least Larry's not going to copyright claim me, right, Larry? Oh, wait, why two belts? Larry and I need to do a collab. I mean, he's got this freaking know. guy. He's doing something, and I want to understand why he's doing it. Cause there's something I don't know here. Anyone? <laughs> and you one. I I'll come to it's I called mummification, Larry. Bah. Whoa. Oh, Slap City. I see, I see. wish I did that years ago. Low key, I wish I did that years ago. <laughs> low key? What the fuck does low key mean? I okay. I Just three? Uh, is this his one max? No. No, no, no. This is my warm up wow. AC. Okay. Okay. Oh, 
Oh yeah, this guy's making yep. landscapers look bad. Yep. Okay, we're not all quarter reppers. Okay. Yep. His his depth is is yep. almost like Larry's. That's probably why Larry right. had to bring him on. He's like, <laughs> okay. I'm not. I, wow. <laughs> there's someone with okay. shittier depth than me. I've never seen someone get into a top set that quickly. That in itself deserves respect. But why are the why is it set so high? So if the bar falls, it, it catches you. Oh, that's why he starts high. But I'm curious, how come you don't want to go any lower? You know, like down here. When do you use that? When do you do that in real life? <laughs> squatting down is squatting down is for girls, I say. And and different time. Uh, oh, he's trying English. When the ramps uh, abajo to play. When you know, play. Mexico is right below America. Yet, this is what we got. And I know I know guys from Germany, and I know people from Holland. That have better English than most Canadians. What's the what's the problem here? Hasta abajo, pesado, medio. And yeah, well, my, my just in case you uh, were born yesterday, Canada and America are basically the same. Es que we just have less black people. Un día le dedico a todas las piernas y tengo lo pesado y pues más o menos. Oh, then he'll go all the way down. Once he gets to his real top set, that was his bottom set. What do you? How much mass can you do? Cuanto, cuanto mass? Apparently, the 808 drums uh, have some sort of hypnotism. Uh, they play frequencies that hypnotize you, and I don't know, turn you into a like a mind slave. But I'm pretty sure you were already at. A, like a irredeemable idiot just from listening to that sort of music and enjoying it. Uh, I think that I think it was what's his name, uh, Kanye West. He said something. I think he, I think that's his thing. Two more. Wait, two more plates? <laughs> no way. Wow, he's not. <laughs> you crazy, man? No clips? Oh, yeah. Okay. He's got his greasy jujitsu shirt on. Ahí va, mijo. Okay. Déjame amarre. No hacen eso así para que me tengan paciencia. Just a minute, they say I got I have to wear four belts this time. I'm glad we're recording this because if not, nobody would believe me. Nobody would believe me if I try to explain what's happening right now. Oh, man. You know, it's. After this video, El Campeon is going to overtake Larry and subscribers. That's, that's a serious I bet you he can't squat 275 below parallel. Hey, that's 600 pounds on the bar. To be exact, it's 595. This is, this is real weight here, okay? And he's like 100%. 170, 180. <sighs> Look at those boots. There's no I do grass stains. How fearless he is. My next question is going to be at some point in this workout. Does he have any injuries? Any uh, huh? any pain injury? He got a sunburn. Nothing. De qué mijo? Oh, sí. No, no, sí. De aquí, de pues de aquí, de sí. Oh, okay. Pero dejo que se recupere. I can't tell because of how you're, <laughs> what you're doing right now. Could have me fooled. I'm gonna make a I didn't okay. expect just any th of this. I think he's just gonna do th three belts. Sure there's clips on there at least. Okay, yeah, three belts. All right. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, here we go. Okay. Larry's not gonna get. Come on, Larry, get up there. Wow. Okay. 
Okay. Walking in. Yep. All right. Powerful wow. set of fives. Got some balls, man. Good <laughs> shit. Wow. See, girls don't care about your abs. They just care about your three-inch 585 squat. <laughs> oh, my God. That's unbelievable. What's he doing here? The portion of the movement. If I tap, it'll go to fix, which will feel like a traditional... Well, what's going on here? Do, uh, the bench press. Well, I want to help Larry with his products, so well, I'll react to that, too. Yeah. I'd like to give a quick shout-out to the Ant Machine. This has to be the most innovative piece of home gym equipment I have ever seen. It's huh? beautiful and it is highly adjustable. If I push in here, the arm adjusts. And it can be yours for a low price of $79,999. If I pull, it goes up or down. Here your, is your local taxes will uh, apply. Is the dial for adding or taking away how much resistance it gives you. Currently, it's actually on Amplify, which will add resistance to the eccentric portion of the movement. If I tap, It'll go to fix, which will feel like a traditional pulley. And oh, man, this is just going to turn the whole hypertrophy game on its head. Band, it'll feel like you're using a band. Over here, we have the wireless smartphone So dock, basically, like, nothing. Of which you can pair with your smartphone and use the AMP app with over a half dozen trainers. It better have a fucking speaker. Because I bet you this... Oh, well, I get, maybe let Daniel tell us how expensive it is. ...that have programs tailored for the machine. I can't get these plates fast enough for this guy. Come on! Come on! He's gonna break his speaker. Okay. Only one plate. Yep. Okay. There it is. Yep. Yes. Ray Strong gets his ass way up, way higher off the pad than this guy. Oh. Okay, these pants are obscene. Yes. Please, I'll, it's, okay. I'll, I'll camp you on. Yes. Beautiful. Yeah. Come on. Yes. Okay. La luz. La luz en Lights are bright. Oh, here we go. I got it, mijo. Got it? This is going to be some, like, Jimmy the Bull assisted bench. Yep. Come on. Oh, he was doing a... Okay. He was doing isometrics. Okay. You got it. Yes. 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 And it's it. Right. Why does he wear bitch mitts? One more. Okay. This guy is probably one of the guys that that is pushing a lawnmower and has mitts on. Yep. Yes. Okay. That's your rep. Oh man, this is getting oh. All right. What else is? He? Oh shit, he does a deadlift. Yes. Okay, he's got the Ronnie Coleman rap style. Power. Yes. Okay. Jesus. He better say what I think he's going to say at the end of this set. Yes. That was basically okay. basketball. Damn. First set. Jesus. Yeah. Ahí va, mijo. Yes. This guy, uh, I don't, this guy must just be a squat specialist. Yes. Ah, uh, Yes. Yep. He has three microphones on. Fuck yeah. Damn. Oh shit. Man, was to grind. We win. We win. He does know how to grind. He actually might be able to pull four or five, which is pretty impressive. Definitely. He can definitely do oh four shit, or five. here you go. At all. You know, if there was somebody that was gonna get injured during the uh from the curse of Larry Wheels, it might be this guy that lifts like a that does squat that squats like I don't know three hundred and fifty pounds more than he should. But he's holding up. Okay. Yeah. Yes. 
Come on! Come on! Oh shit! Yeah, you gotta. It's way out in front of you, uh, Hector. Oh my goodness! I've been practicing the pull. Okay, well we max we max you out here. We we max them out. <laughs> we fully exhausted the chance. When did you start working out? Como diez años, ten years. Ten years. Pero yo solo me pues nomás mirando videos videos uh, revistas libros magazines okay. men's okay. health magazine must must have been that. <laughs> yeah. gave me a whole new perspective on training <laughs> I was taught to warm up you know and all this and then you just come in here 42 no warm up straight to four plates <laughs> Ben skip five right to six nice to look older this guy oh shit he's 42 that's unbelievable oh, guys if you're in need of wrist wraps elbow wraps Belt, sleeves, any weightlifting equipment, prlifestyle.com. Oh, I thought he was going to say that that guy's got it in his bag for you, and he can lend you one. Link down below in the description box, and please stay tuned. This month on Black Friday, we'll we be releasing over a dozen different colors for the sleeves, the wraps, and so much more. Don't, be, don't miss out. Our champion, thank you so much for being a good sport. We got to see what he's really capable of on the squat bench and deadlift. He's got some abs. You can see it through his shirt. That's what really counts. So, anyways, what we learned today is that uh, uh, Larry's not uh, Larry's number two now in in his gym.